This is Red Feather from Grip Hacks. In this Kidding Live video, we will be showing you more about the Spacer tool. In our last Kidding Live video, we showed you how to group a portion of a video, dragging all of the video using the Spacer double arrow we will begin there. The spacer tool function, like any other function of KDN Live, is put to good use when it saves editing time. But in order to do this, the function must be utilized. Being that said, open KDN Live, bring in the video you would like to edit, make the edits you would like, such as cuts and or deletion of video, audio, and so forth that is needed. Move the back portion of your Kading Live video to meet up with the one before it. Once this is done, go to the Kading Live title bar, click on the tool drop down menu, scroll down to the spacer tool, and click. Your mouse should now appear with double arrows. Grab the edited clips you position together with the double arrow. This will move them as a group. Pull the group to the left on the timeline in order to remove the space. Once you are done moving your video as a group, return to the KD Live title bar. Click on the tool drop down menu, scroll down to the selection tool, and click. There are other Kading Live Spacer tool functions, and there are a couple of different ways to utilize them. For this example, we will start out with the timeline drop down menu. So, in the title bar, click the timeline drop down menu. Scroll down to space, scroll over and down to remove space and click. Notice a track window appears. Indicating live track window, click the drop down arrow, scroll down to the proper track you desire, then click OK. But notice that as I have clicked on the track to be moved, nothing has happened. In the lower right hand corner of Katie and Live, it posted an error message stating what went wrong. In order to use this function, your Katie and Live line marker must be in a clear area on the timeline of the area to re remove the space. So I will move my line marker to the area that is clear on the Kading Live timeline. Go back to the title bar, click on the timeline menu once again. Scroll down to space, scroll over to, and down to remove space and click. Once the Kading Live Remove Space window appears, click the drop down arrow, scroll to the proper track, and cl click. And then click OK. Now notice it removed the necessary space. Now let me readjust my Kading Live timeline and show you another way. On the Kadian Live timeline, right click in the clear area of the track of the video of the space to be removed. Scroll down to remove space and click. The Kadian Live remove all space function seems to be a bit odd. As you may have noticed, on my Kadian Live timeline, it did not remove all the space on video track one, although 
it did move it as far as the upper and lower video and audio track. You can also insert a space. I have yet to discover the purpose for this, but go to the KDN Live title bar, go to the timeline, and click. Scroll down to space, scroll over to insert space, and click. A Kadian Live duration window will appear. Click the drop down menu, scroll down to the proper track, and then click OK. Now notice it created a space. Now let us do this again, this time adjusting the duration of the Kadian Live insert space function. Go back to the Kading Live title bar, go to Timeline, scroll down to Space, scroll over and click on Insert. Once the Kading Live Insert Space Duration window appears, adjust the duration to what you would like it to be. Ensure the proper track is selected and then click OK. Notice it has now created a larger blank space. If it is too large, you can still manually adjust the space. However, if after using the KDN Live insert space function, you cannot then use the KDN Live remove space. As you will notice, the error message in the lower right hand corner of my KDN Live as it, as it says, it causes a video collision. I hope you have enjoyed this Kading Live tutorial and found it helpful in some fashion. And if so, then why not give this video a like? And while you're at it, why not become a subscriber? And ring that bell in order to be notified your way of newly released videos. <laughs> I mean, after all, it is free. The intro and extra of this video has been provided by none other than Alex Abayu one from his YouTube channel. Thank you in advance. I am...